Hi friends, did you know that tiny specks of rare minerals beneath our feet in India might just be the key to the world's clean energy transition? Let's zoom in. The National Critical Mineral Mission NCMM, was launched by the Ministry of Mines, Government of India to build a resilient supply chain of critical minerals, those essential for electric vehicles, EVs, wind and solar power, defence, electronics. India is heavily dependent on imports for many of these minerals like lithium, nickel, cobalt, rare earths. Geographic distributions matter. Some minerals are clustered in certain states, making exploration and value chains strategically important. From a geography exam point of view, location plus resource plus value chain equals spatial dynamics of development. The mission covers the entire value chain, exploration, mining, beneficiation, processing, recycling of end-of-life products. Target 1,200 domestic exploration projects by 2030 to 31 across India. Fast-track regulatory processes, overseas acquisitions, setting up of processing parks and stockpiles. Recently, the Ministry of Mines recognized two more institutes as COEs under NCMM. Indian Institute of Science, Bangalore and Centre for Materials for Electronics Technology, CMET, Hyderabad. They joined seven previously recognized. These COEs will act as hubs in a hub and spoke model. Each hub must bring in at least two industry partners plus two R&D or academic partners. Together, the nine COEs now have about 90 industry plus academic spokes. Bangalore and Hyderabad become centers of mineral tech innovation, influencing regional development, skilled labor flows, ecosystem building, spatial resource endowment, India's critical minerals are unevenly distributed. States with rare earths, graphite, lithium potential become hotspots. For example, Rajasthan, Andhra, Tamil Nadu for rare earths. Value chain clustering. Where you process minerals matters as much as where you extract them. COEs in urban tech hubs show shift from extraction to tech plus manufacturing. Strategic location and global supply security. India's dependence on imports makes location plus diplomacy plus geography important. NCMM tries to reduce this risk. For UPSC, tie this into resources and development, technology mission and value chains, regional disparities. So the next time you see an EV zooming by, remember, somewhere below our soil are the minerals powering it. And India's mission to become a global hub is very much a geography story.